move on to my final point. My sisters and my brothers. But what I like about this text is that not only did God send help from an unexpected place. But God sent help in a way that was not expected. And often we expect God to work things out in some miraculous, supernatural way. Uh, but this time God didn't take the heat out of the fire like he did for the Hebrew boys. God didn't clothe the mouths of hungry lions like he did for Daniel. God didn't part the Red Sea like he did for the children of Israel. He didn't give Ebed Melech a staff like Moses had. He didn't have a slingshot like David had. He didn't have an arrow or some other type of tool or a weapon. But Ebed Melech only had a few things that you would never think would be valuable to save his life. He didn't have any ladders to let down and rescue Jeremiah so he went to the storehouse and he gathered up some rags and some worn out clothes and he let them down to Jeremiah in the cistern by ropes and he told the prophet to put the rags under your armpits between your body and the ropes and he bet Malik lifted the prophet from the mud with nothing but rags and ropes so my final point my sisters and my brothers you ought to lean on somebody and tell them that God can lift you with rags and ropes. He didn't have any sophisticated equipment, but he didn't need any sophisticated equipment. All he needed was what God made available to him, and that was rags and ropes. And I suspect that somebody in here tonight knows what it's like uh, to be saved by rags and ropes uh, for when others took the ham and ate high off the hog uh, we took the rags and the ropes uh, we took the feet the ears uh, the tail and the chitterlings uh, and fed ourselves until times could get better. Uh, some of us made it through school not because of scholarships that we received, uh, but because of the rag and rope donation uh, that we got from grandma and uncle them. Uh, and many days those rags and rope donation uh, put food on our table, uh, put gas in our car. Uh, our churches were not endowed uh, like other churches, um, but we survived and thrived uh, because faithful, hard-working, Holy Spirit-filled people uh, bring their little rag and rope offering uh, and make a sacrifice to the Lord. Uh, and when we bring them to God, uh, they seem so small, uh, but when we tie them together, uh, the Lord has a way uh, of stretching them uh, and we can make it uh, on the rags uh, and ropes. Uh, we weren't saved by some great liturgical uh, or some marvelous intellectual theory, uh, but we were saved uh, by a carpenter's son uh, who spent his life in ministry in the mud uh, with stinky fishermen, uh, Galilean sodbusters uh, who were his disciples. And, uh, he hung out uh, with muddy people. Uh, bless his name. Uh, he hung out with tax collectors. 
sicknesses uh, and sinners uh, hung around with lepers and, uh, and prostitutes uh, was hung between dying thieves uh, he was muddy uh, but one day have mercy uh, one day uh, on a hill uh, called Calvary uh, I heard the songwriter say uh, bless his name uh, on a hill uh, far away uh, stood an old uh, rugged cross uh, an emblem uh, of suffering and shame uh, and I love that old cross uh, where the dearest and the best uh, for a world lost sinners uh, was slain I will cherish uh, that old rugged cross uh, till my trophies and, uh, one day I'll lay down uh, I will cling to the old rugged cross uh, and exchange it uh, one day for a crown uh, he bore uh, a ragged rope rugged cross and, uh, and died uh, for my sins uh, he came uh, to where I was uh, in the mud uh, and he lifted me uh, from grime to grace uh, lifted me uh, from sin to salvation uh, lifted me uh, from helplessness to hope uh, lifted me uh, from failure to faith uh, lifted me uh, from trouble to triumph uh, he lifted me uh, from vice to victory uh, he lifted me uh, from hell to heaven uh, and I wonder uh, if there's anybody else uh, who can testify uh, from sinking sand he lifted me uh, so when you see me praise him uh, don't call emotional uh, understand uh, that I've been lifted uh, with rags uh, and ropes and, uh, when you see me uh, refusing to return evil for evil uh, don't call me foolish uh, I've been lifted uh, with rags uh, and ropes and, uh, when you see me uh, giving my tithe uh, and serving the Lord uh, don't tell me uh, that I'm crazy just know I've been lifted with rags and ropes I was sinking deep in sin far from the peaceful shore very deeply stained within sinking around no more but the man of the sea had my despairing cry from the water he lifted me love lifted me love lifted me when nothing else could help love Lifted me. Do I have anybody in here who can testify that he lifted me? He picked me up. He turned me around. He placed my feet on solid ground. And because he lifted me, I'm going to lift him out to reach the masses. Men of every birth uh, for an answer uh, Jesus gave the key uh, he said if I if I be lifted uh, from the earth uh, I'll draw all uh, oh, men under me uh, somebody ought to lift him uh, because he brought you uh, lift him uh, because he taught you uh, lift him uh, because he kept you uh, lift him uh, because he never left you uh, lift him uh, because he made a way uh, lift him uh, because 
Lift him, but he saved your son. Lift him.